What? Good, everybody. Woo. What's going on, everybody? If you're new to the channel, my name is Jay Coop, and I am going to get veneers in Miami. Yee! I am at the airport currently, and I am headed to Miami to get my pearly whites. Now, this is a big procedure, man. Veneers are no joke. I'm going to Dental Design Smile, and I'm getting the composite resin veneers. Let me give you an up close of my smile real quick. So my smile is not bad, but it's not perfect. And I'm going for that perfect look, people. AKA the ping ping smile, you know what I'm talking about. This is gonna be a journey, guys. I'm gonna be telling you the price. I'm gonna be showing Ariel you the location. I'm gonna be showing you the whole procedure. Right, so make sure you watch the whole video and get all this information I'm gonna be dropping on the composite veneers. I don't know exactly how much I'm paying now, but I already put $500 down. We're gonna get more into that once we're actually at the office. Now that you guys know I'm getting my veneers, let's hop on this plane, get to Miami, and get that new million dollar smile, baby. Come for the ride, it's gonna be fun. Aye. So guys, here's the form that you're gonna have to sign when you get your veneers from Dental Design Smile. They're gonna give you your card type, your card number, of course, that's blurred out, phone number, name, then your signature, and I signed this on May 2nd. It is currently June 17th. Okay guys, made it up to Dental Design Smile. About to go in and see what they say. Hopefully we can film. This is my first appointment right here, so this is the big one. We're gonna see how much it's gonna cost. We're gonna see the whole everything. Like, Let's see what they say and let's get these veneers, baby. Before, after. guys this is my second appointment today it is june 19 2020 i am up here at dental design smile as you can see i cannot film inside of there so i'm gonna get as much b-roll as possible but today i'm going to be getting my gums cut a gingivectomy i don't know exactly what that is and i guess they're just going to fit my teeth and make sure everything is fine so i'm going to give you guys more of a breakdown once i leave we'll do like a little sit down and i tell you more of the cost more of everything else and let's go in man appointments at 12 it's currently 11 53 if you're not on time you're late if you're on time you're late whenever i said hope it makes sense my dad taught me that all right y'all let's get it Aye. All right, y'all walking in. I can't film, let's see how it goes. Let's go. Okay guys, I just left out a dental design smile. This is my second appointment. My mouth feels weird. So they did the gum cutting. I think you can see it on this gum. Looks like it's higher. They had to numb my mouth. So my mouth feels weird right here. She told me not to eat. They were good, but they were a little rough like like the water was splashing everywhere. So I'm just kind of used to my dentist being more, you know, like clean with it. Cause she knows I don't really want water all on me, but it's hot in Miami. So like, I'm not really tripping on the water. They also did a gingivectomy. Like we already talked about that. And they also did something to where like my bite on like my back is supposed to be even but when they put the veneers on there. It's so like, it does feel kind of weird, but she said I can eat once this numbing goes down. So. Let's see if I can show you the inside of my mouth. All right. Other than that, it was smooth sailing. I have my appointment. They were able to push me up on my appointment. It's gonna be at 8 a.m. on Monday. It was originally supposed to be, at, be on Tuesday at 8 a.m. So I get a whole full day with my veneers. So I'm excited, guys. I don't know if I'm gonna do a sit down and talk to you guys again or not, or if, if we're just gonna see each other on the day of the procedure but either way it goes about to go through this journey together and i hope you're enjoying the video now it's time for me to hit miami y'all that'll be on another video another vlog make sure you hit that subscribe button make sure you follow me on instagram at jackson s cooper and we're gonna keep it fresh and keep it clean that's how we do over here y'all all right let's get these veneers Today is the day. My smile 
will look completely different. What's going on guys? Today is the day of the procedure. I am getting my veneers. It is currently 6.15 in the morning, Monday, June 22nd. I'm excited, man. So they told me to eat. I gotta get my grapes in. A little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie to you, because this is like changing my whole appearance, my whole mouth. So I'm about to eat these grapes, get dressed. We're gonna head up there. I pray I can get some good footage for you guys. I want you to see it. But we're definitely gonna look at the teeth afterwards. And let's let's go along for this journey, man. This is the real deal. This is raw footage. Million dollar smile, baby. Yes, sir. Turn left into the parking lot and arrive at your Okay guys, four minutes early as always. Punctuation is key. Appointment is at 8 a.m. All right guys, about to head in right now. Don't know how much filming we could do, but like I said, let's get it popping. I'm feeling fresh, I'm feeling clean, but I did forget my mask. Let's go y'all, let's get these teeth. Ping ping whites, baby. Five hours later. Yes, sir. How they looking? She. What's your name? My lips are like a little bit numb, guys, but I'm feeling fresh. I'm trying to get like a thumbnail. Like, couldn't use like my regular camera, so I'm trying to look at y'all and talk. But yeah, man, like how do y'all like them? We're gonna get more in depth. I'm like still in the chair right now. Stopping a little bit funny, but it's cause like my bottom mouth is numb. All right, well. <laughs> Thank you, Dental Design Smile, for my beautiful million dollar smile. I will be back for the porcelains, but these are beautiful. There are lovely people here, and I really appreciate it. Make sure you check them out here in Miami. Okay, guys, got the veneers done. Plus. I'm flussing, I'm flussing, I'm flussing. Mouth is still a little numb. Doesn't really feel that, that weird talking except for like at the bottom, but I like them, man. I'm gonna make sure to do a sit down and break down of the cost and everything. As you can see, beautiful weather, palm trees in the back. I gotta go enjoy my new smile. Perfect. Let's get it, y'all. I think I need to buy some floss right now, guys, just to be safe. I'm at Family Dollar. No, I'm at Dollar Tree. I think I should buy some floss. And they said get the soft toothbrush. So I might, should get that as well. Shouts out to Dollar Tree for the floss and the soft brush. Okay guys, we are back. I am about to break down everything that goes on when getting your composite veneers. Let me get some water, it's hot out here in Miami. Okay, let's get straight into when I got into the chair. So I couldn't film, right? He showed me the before of my teeth and then he started doing them. So it didn't really hurt at all. He had to numb my bottom because this crooked tooth here. You see how they're not like lined up perfect like that? They had to numb me up a couple shots because he had to shave my teeth. So he shaved my two front teeth and he shaved that crooked tooth that was right here. It didn't really hurt, but the worst part about sitting in that chair, my appointment was at 8 a.m. and it ended at around 2, 2.30. I had to pee really bad like two times, man. <laughs> like it was crazy, but he was like super cool. The person who did my teeth and everything was thank you and you're welcome. I'm still getting used to talking with these, but like it's not too difficult to talk, but they are very nice at Dental Design Smile. That is a plus right there. One thing though, if you don't know Spanish, they're gonna be speaking a lot of Spanish around you. So he's doing my teeth. I really don't know what's going on at this point. I just have to pee really bad, so he does the top, right? Yeah, he's like, you wanna see? Him, so like he shows me, he's like, yeah, like you're not polished or nothing. Like I'm looking and I'm like, man, it looks different. But like it looked crazy because it was like the top, the bottom still like how it was regular. So like I went back in, we did the bottoms. Like my bottom is like my worst area because it's crowded. Did the bottoms, I think they came out great. I was happy with the whole results. Let's give you a breakdown on the cost. In the month of May, they had a sale where you get 500 off of the procedure. Now I don't know how this works because I paid the $500 deposit, but the 500 came out of what I paid. So my whole total for my veneers, my gin, givectomy, and my occlusional adjustment was $4,450 for everything. It's a low, that's a lot of money. But the way that I look at life is like this. If you're gonna make an investment, who you gonna make that investment in? I'll give you a second. 
yourself. You're your biggest investment. Nothing else. Shoes, clothes, that comes and goes. But how you look, that means something. So, money well spent. Now, let me give you some aftercare that they're gonna tell you what to do when you have your composite resin veneers. Brush with an extra soft toothbrush at least twice a day, especially before bed. I do that anyway, but I brush with an electric brush, but I'm gonna stop doing that because you don't wanna be too harsh on these. I'm taking all the necessary precautions to where I'm not gonna mess up this investment. They also say, don't rinse with the mouthwash. I wasn't doing that anyway because I already had bonding on my teeth and mouth rinses have alcohol in them and that can break down the composite resin bond. That's a no-no, you don't want to do that. And the most important thing that he told me to keep my veneers in tip-top shape is a water pick. I will be picking that up as soon as I get back home. I don't know which one to get. He said get the biggest one with the most water. I don't know about that. I'm gonna do my research. Uh, he said do that twice a day. That should help out a lot. And I guess water picks get into places to even wear floss can. If you're thinking about getting some veneers, that is an investment that you will be picking up as well. Okay, guys. That is my veneer journey here in Miami. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and make sure you smash that like button so other people can see what it's like to get their composite veneers. If you're coming down here to Miami to Dental Design Smile or anywhere to get your veneers. Also, follow me on Instagram at Jackson S. Cooper. If you take anything away from this video, guys, Remember, the biggest investment you can make is in you. Always remember that. Stay blessed, y'all. Stay safe. Until next time, peace. Two weeks later, and I'm back. Now, I'm going back to Miami to get the veneers taken off. I'm at the airport, Columbus Airport. It's kind of busy up here, too, but I'm going to kind of break down more on why I'm going to get them taken off. It's a lot of different things. I mean, we have some... We have some pain, we have some discomfort. And like in all honesty, I just want my natural teeth back. It's gonna be another journey. I'm only here for a day, so I'm hoping we can get it done quick. We will. One thing I noticed about the airport, just for like a little side note about the airport, I don't think a lot of people take showers before they come, man. I don't know, maybe they do. All right, guys, made it on the flight, headed to Miami. The mirror's gotta go. I'm suited to move it, man. Get back at y'all, I'll land in. I am. Uh,